For more than three years, New Mexico United has been trying to get a stadium of its own. Last month, Albuquerque City Councilors voted to move forward with that plan, but now another roadblock. Neighborhoods around Balloon Fiesta Park are not giving up in their fight against it. And this time they're taking their concerns to court. Reporter Christiana Ramos is live with details. Doug Shelley, we spoke to a former city councilor who has sat in on several land use hearings, and he says that the neighbor's recent actions may not change anything, but it could cause delays. During an environmental planning commission meeting in April, Albuquerque City Council voted to reject a final appeal from neighbors to build the New Mexico United Soccer Stadium at Balloon Fiesta Park. Councilor Lewis. Yes. That passes on an 8 win vote. The neighbors now taking the match to district court. This is a notice of appeal filed on September 17th. In it, the neighbors citing similar concerns they had then. This is what one resident had to say when Target 7 spoke to her in March. The noise, the light, other types of pollution that come with building a stadium for that many people. Pat Davis is a former city councilor who sat in on several land use hearings. They're essentially asking the court to start over and do a mini trial to determine if the city's process uh, was fair and equitable and included everybody in the process. He says although this play will delay United's plans, it means that opportunities for other funding might go away. Um, you know, if this really drags out for months, the United is going to have to go back to its, its investors and say, are we willing to hold that money up for a little while? He says it most likely won't score the neighbors the outcome they're looking for. So is it likely to come back to the city council? Maybe. Is it likely to get overturned? History tells us probably not. But United says they're determined to get to the goal. We care about this community. We care about providing something that we can all be proud of. And we're not going anywhere. In a statement Wednesday, United owner Pete Trevisani says, quote, we've met with the neighbors multiple times and have incorporated changes into the design to align with their requests for reduced light, traffic and noise. Trevisani also says that he remains confident that the court will agree that the process that led to the decision to build the stadium will still stand. No hearings have been scheduled yet. Reporting live from Balloon Fiesta Park, Christiana Ramos, KOAT, Action 7 News. We weren't able to get a comment from the attorney representing the three neighborhood groups. United hopes to have that stadium built by 2026.